Hi, I'm Sam Chitwood of Cadence Design Systems. Welcome to another installment of Sigurdy Tech Tips. Today we bring you tips on how to sign off your IC package design. This video will show you how to resolve common IC package electrical concerns while your IC package is being designed. Using this methodology, you can avoid wasting weeks of project time on design respins due to relatively straightforward problems not being found until late in the design cycle. Instead of completing the IC package design and handing it over to the IC package characterization engineers for initial electrical analysis, IC package designers are now empowered to run Sigurdy Electrical Package Assessment Technology directly from Allegro Package Designer or Cadence SIP. This allows common electrical problems to be discovered and fixed during the IC package design task. Electrical package assessment is an important step in an IC package design sign-off methodology. By enabling IC package designers to resolve signal impedance discontinuities, crosstalk, and unbalanced power pin loading conditions, the IC package characterization engineers are allowed to focus on more demanding 3D modeling and characterization tasks. With these tasks completed earlier, the difficult IC package analysis task can be given proper focus. You can complete the sign-off process on time and in budget. In this video, we will utilize Allegro Package Designer and Sigurdy Extract IM. To learn more about these products, visit us at www.cadence.com. Now I will turn it over to my colleague, Charlie Shi. Hi, this is Charlie Shi from Cadence Design Systems. In this video, we are going to introduce Sigurdy Extract IM access from Allegro Package Designer and SIP layout. Traditionally, a layout designer sends a package design to electrical engineer to do SIPI analysis for critical nets, waiting for a few days to few weeks to get a response for design change. Now, starting from Allegro 17.2, layout designer can access secret ETRIM from APD. The EPA result from ETRIM can provide layout engineer comprehensive electrical information to design better packages. With the cross probing between APD and ExtraRM EPA result viewers, layout designer can room in a hotspot in ExtraRM EPA result viewers to bring up the location in APD to optimize their design. In the package design, it's very common to add layers that are not existing in the real package for specific purpose, for example, solid mass creation. Those layers need to be cleaned up before going to simulation. The C4 bump profile on a free chip die and the salt bowl profile on a BGA component and molding compound material property need to be considered in the simulation. In APD layout designer can input the loss profile and the setting is a one-time effort. In this integration flow, Layout designer can access ETRIM either in GUI or batch mode. In early design stage, designer can select only critical nets to perform EPA analysis for best performance. To the final design stage, designer can run the whole package design EPA analysis. Access is security ETRIM from APD empower layout designer an efficient way to design better packages in a shorter time. This flow is started from APT, run batch mode EPA. When simulation is completed, result view will be displayed side by side with APT. Designer can easily identify the design weakness according to the color spectrum in the result viewers. Room into those red color area will bring up the corresponding location in APT. In the next iteration, designer modify the design in APT, save the design, and rerun the simulation. The design change will be automatically updated to ExtraRM. So the design can be optimized very soon. Layout designer can also generate a RLC report from APT, including SPICE model and RLC table. Just few parameter input, you are all set to generate a package model. Next, we'll demo extra IM access from Allegro Package Designer for a free chip package design. Here we are in APD environment. We select Package Analyze option license to enable extra IM access. 
For this design, they are two dummy layers, so we check them on in XI Ignore column. Save the design to reflect the change. Under the Analyze, there is the IM menu bar. We select Batch Mode for this demo. Select Impedance and Cross Top. Here you can set up the C4 Bump Profile and BGS or the Bulb Profile. And set up the only compound material. Now the simulation is started, you can check the progress by this bar. Now the simulation is completed, the result viewer and APD is displayed side by side. Firstly, you can check the impedance distribution on each layer. The red color means high impedance and the deep blue means the low impedance. So you can go back to the APD to figure out what's wrong with the design. For the high impedance traces, obviously there is no reference plane, so you can slightly move them to make it have a reference plane underneath. For those low impedance traces, you can try to decrease the trace width to increase the impedance. We can go back to the EPA result viewer to continue to check the crosstalk. There are two hotspots for crosstalk on the bottom area. Back to the APD, you can try to enlarge the spacing for those traces. And you can continue to room in the hotspot in the EPA result viewer and then back to the APD to enlarge the spacing for those traces. Now you can cross the RM and back to the APT, save the design change to the other file. Next, you can continue to run the EPA analysis based on previous setting. Now simulation is completed. Again, you can see Result viewer and APD is displayed side by side. Now you can see the high impedance and the low impedance is getting better. And for the cross talk, the hotspot is also away. Now back to the APD, you can continue to to run the extraction. You can set up the extraction frequency. For example, change is to 500 megahertz. Based on the previous setting, you can do the model extraction. Now the extraction is completed, you can check the resistance, inductance, capacitance plus for each NAS. And you can also get the SPICE model and RC table in a working directory. Here we conclude the demo. Thank you for watching another edition of Security Tech Tips. For more information on products shown in this video, click on the links below or contact your local Cadence sales representative or Cadence channel partner.